Let's learn programming in Alta Chem 220. To begin with, let us start with an endpoint reaction. Endpoint assay is in which sample is incubated with the buffered substrate for a fixed period of time and at the end of the reaction it is stopped and the amount of product formed or substrate used is estimated. Let's run the most common test glucose in Chem 220. Select test setup and program for glucose as per the system parameter given in the true chemical glucose insert. Enter the required details from the insert as per the options given. Enter name, method, filter, delay or incubation time, testing or read time. Here it is just 5 seconds, it is an endpoint reaction. Enter normal ranges and linearity levels. Now select calibration option given on the top. Select calibration type as two point linear and enter reagent in blank for all endpoint reactions. Points select two to get one option of standard selected. Enter the standard value. Then save the data. Remember to enter reagent blank for endpoint reactions. Arrange required test tubes. Take the glucose mono reagent Add 1 ml in each test tube. First tube is meant for reagent blank and the second tube add 10 microliter of glucose standard to calibrate the instrument for the parameter. Standard should be repeated if required. To the third test tube add QC and to the fourth add sample. Standard can be repeated if factors are not in range. Place the tubes including reagent blank in the incubator. Go to the menu screen and select test menu. In that, select the required page and then the required parameter. The testing page opens and message aspirate water is displayed. Once distilled water is aspirated, the display shows pump aspirate. Once aspirated, it displays testing in process and the OD is displayed. Then it is ready for running the reagent black. OK the same and aspirate reagent black. The process repeats and reagent OD is displayed. Now the instrument is ready to run the standard. Once given OK, it will ask to aspirate standard and the standard is run and OD is displayed. QC can be run if required to confirm the performance. QC has to be selected and then aspirated. Values and lot already stored in QC menu. Once QC is OK, you can check the values and then run the samples. Now, let's run a fixed kinetic mode with standard, say urea. Kinetic mode depends on the rate of reaction. When taken at two points, it's fixed or two point kinetic. And when readings are taken at multiple points, it is called kinetic reaction. The programming is done as per the system parameters given in the true chemical kit insert. Name the test, mode, filter, delay time, read time and all other details are entered and saved. Then water blank is run. We skip reagent blank in kinetic reaction. And if standard is given, then standard is run. And if standard is not there, in some of the kinetic reactions, we run sample directly and enter the factor given in the insert. Once we run the standard, we get the factor and check if the factor attained is within the range and if it's correct, give OK for sample or else repeat the standard. Once the sample is aspirated, the decreasing graph in urea is seen on the screen and the result is generated. In parameters where factors are given, Factor can be directly entered in column K by selecting one point linear in calibration. Programming of bilirubin total. Bilirubin total and direct is different as it is run in two point end mode or in some instruments indicated as a differential endpoint mode. Excess of bilirubin imparts color to the serum to nullify the same. In bilirubin, we generally run sample blank. Now, in the test setting, go to Analyze, New Page and Program for Bilirubin Total. Add test name, unit, 
filters, incubation and read time, decimals, normal rain, linearity, temperature, etc. Now go to calibration page and enter type of calibration as one point and add the factor value. Here blank is sample blank, but water blank is selected as sample blank option is not displayed. Go to the menu and select test. Test page is displayed. Select the options below ribbon total and then the real time screen pops up. The instrument mentions to run water blank. Water blank is aspirated. Then it goes to sample mode and since mode is 2.n, it first asks for A1 which is sample blank, which is reagent 1 plus sample. Then we have to aspirate A2 which is reagent 1 plus reagent 2 and sample. Once aspirated, both the OD are displayed and the difference in them is multiplied with the factor to get the result. It is noted that each sample we have to run twice, once as sample blank and once as sample. Now let's program for HbA1c which includes 5 calibrators. Set the program by adding test, name, method, filter, time setting and aspiration setting. Linearity in HbA1c depends on the highest value of calibrator provided. Now select calibration page. In calibration type enter spline and blank reagent in which standard 1 is added and at point select 5 so that four calibrator concentrations can be entered. Save the calibration screen. Take five test tube with reagent 1. Add 300 microliter of reagent 1 into each of the test tubes. Then add each of the five calibrators one by one of around 8 microliters and mix well. Incubate it for five minutes and then add R2 100 microliter in each of the test tube and again incubate for 5 minutes. Now select the test page, run water blank as message appears on the screen, then run reagent blank followed by other calibrators one by one. Check the calibration curve. The instrument get ready to go to sample mode. If the calibration curve is good, then the sample can be run. The sample is run and the results are displayed. For running samples in cuvette mode, usually used for coagulation parameters, we can directly insert the reaction tubes in the flow set area with adapter or directly as per requirement. It's important the option cuvette mode should be selected from system under system setup heading of the main menu while doing the cuvette mode. In this video, we have shown the programming of endpoint mode, two point end, kinetic reaction with standard and also programming involving multi-standard. Contact us for any clarification at 73977-84174. Alta Chem 220 is a user-friendly instrument with high-quality reagents at affordable price.